Hey everyone, Ross here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new update video for Arena Breakout. And yes, you are seeing right in the title. We look it looks like we're getting a new map. Now it's been a while since I've done a video like this, so just bear with us. And this update is in fact due at the end of December for the Chinese version. Which obviously, if it's coming to the Chinese version, it's going to be future global content. So if you are playing the global, you haven't played the Chinese version or you haven't got access, it will be coming in a future update. Now, little disclaimer before I get into this, guys. It is very loosely translated. It's from the WeChat uh, account of the official account. And it's just the basic basically a Chinese translation. So I've tried to the best of my ability to sort of interpret it, what it's seeing um, and bring you the information as best I can. So like I say, this is due at the end of December, end of this year. So next month in January, we will have this update on the Chinese version, I will try my best to cover it. So without further ado guys, if you do us a massive favour, hit that subscribe button on the channel so you don't miss any updates. Anything of course I find out, I will be posting a new video about. So without further ado guys, let's get straight into this one. <music> So then guys, the news you're all waiting for in this video is the fact that we're getting a new map. Now if you're not familiar with the, uh, the Chinese version, if you're just familiar with the global, you'll know there's Farm, Valley and Northridge. There's also TV Station and Fortress slash Armory which is uh, currently available in the Chinese version. Now this is a 6 map for the game and it's called Naval Port or military harbour i'm going to assume if you look at the map and game it's going to be around about the bottom right area of that map now going off the previews guys i'm going to be flashing them in the background now of the screenshots currently available on wechat it's going to it's looking like an urban focused map so it looks like more like like streets and buildings and you know a bit more close-knit compared to the other maps as opposed to a wide open sort of green area where you're going to run across it looks a bit more like see a tv station but on a bigger scale so i'm hoping there's going to be lots of indoor areas and lots of sort of alleyways and like narrow streets and stuff to get lost in hopefully it's going to be a bit more cqc etc now it's got hints on the wechat of a new boss i'm assuming new map will bring a new scout boss however many of these i'm not really sure there could be several red zones there could be just one it will have to wait and see now there was a test qualification up last month, which I missed, which was a, pardon me, a chance to test this map. Now, what I've done is I've contacted the developers myself. And I've said, look, is there any way I can get on in, in on this test? I know it's late, but I would really like to sort of feature this on the channel sort of thing. Now, it's not possible for them to give us a test qualification to try out the map. However, the half put us into talks with one of the Chinese content creators. I can't remember his name off the top of my head. But allegedly, he's going to give me some gameplay footage from the new map. He's going to like play through a map, play through a game of it and send us the video to sort of edit into a video myself and talk about it. Now, it's hinting at a new mode on this map. So... From room, as I've heard, I don't want to say this is definitely what's going to happen because I don't want to sort of build your hopes up. But it's looking like a battle royale type gear mode where you don't spawn in with any gear other than maybe it's a pistol or something like that and you have to loot on the map. But I think it's going to be the same sort of situation where you still have extraction points and you still have to loot and blah blah and you keep everything at the end you're just not able to go into the match with anything now that's of course a rumor guys that's what i've heard from some people who have uh, experienced it and stuff and i'm hoping it might be just be like a, a secondary mode i'm hoping there's still the regular looter shooter tarkov style gear mode on the game itself on this map as well i'm hoping it's like a secondary mode because i i can see it being quite interesting but not if it's the be-all and end-all and it's the only one you can play. So hopefully we'll see that coming very, very soon. Now, aside from the map, guys, we've got a couple of other um, updates coming that 
like I say, I've loosely translated it. I've tried my best to interpret what it's uh, saying. But apparently you're going to have a personal location stronghold to show off weapons to other players. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but if you think Lost Light when you've got your, your lobby, you're running around your shelter, you've got your weapon racks, you've got your, your, your warehouse and stuff, you actually run to it as opposed to having a menu. I'm hoping this means we're going to have player shelters where we can gradually upgrade and run around in, in a lobby style thing as opposed to just a menu with clicky buttons and blah, blah. That feature would be absolutely amazing. I don't know about you, but I'm really excited for that if that's what I'm translating. If it's going to be player shell as it's going to be something completely different to what we've got now and it's going to be so much better. Now, lastly, guys, one more thing that I've deciphered from this translation is hints, and I say hints very loosely, at death replays or kill cams so if you get killed by someone it's going to either zoom in and show you where they were and what they killed you with or if i'm wrong it's more detailed reports of how someone killed you I, i'm not really sure i'll tell you the truth it's very loose like i say the translation isn't always 100 percent what it means i'm trying my best to sort of give you the accurate thing but i'm hoping it does mean kill cams i would be very interested to see where joe blogs killed us from from 200 meters away and what he was doing and how he was aiming and how good his vision was and stuff like that just to really know what i did wrong you know it's a learning game you get killed you want to know why you got killed or how you got killed i would be I really appreciate a kill cam on this game just so i know what's going on anyway guys <coughs> if you are on the chinese version Season 1 is due to end the end of this month, end of December, and we're pushing into Season 2 with this new content. And like I say, the global version probably going to end the closed beta test round about the same time as that. Don't know how long between CBT1 and CBT2 will be. Hopefully it's not very long at all, but we'll, we'll find out and hopefully we can get some new content on the global. I would love to do TV station on a decent ping anyway. So, like I say, guys, I'll be covering this update on the Chinese server. I will be playing on the Chinese server to sort of experience a new gameplay, etc. So, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, make sure you do. You'll be able to see everything that should be coming to the global version. And, of course, any global news or updates I do get, I will be telling you on the channel. I'm not one of these people who sort of keeps things back. If I find something out and I'm allowed to see it, I will tell you i'll do a video or i'll put on my community wall or even on discord ask us on discord if i've got any news i'm more than happy to share anyway guys if you're not on my discord make sure you do join it uh, there's lots of players on there if you are struggling to find a group obviously i'm on there as well if you want to group up with me occasionally on live stream or whatever you can and please do click the link tree in the description follow me on our socials i post clips i post thoughts etc on twitter you name it anyway guys thanks so much for watching i hope we're going to get kill cams i hope the new maps coming to global very soon because i just want to just get on it you know and just see what this new mode's like you see the new boss etc anyway guys thanks so much for watching and hopefully i'll see you in the next one bye bye for now